Preserving the past at Gilcrease Museum. Curators are taking measures to ensure the collection of rare documents is around for years to come. 2 News multimedia journalist Chris Wiley shows us their work. It's an uncomfortable chapter in America's story. The importation of African slaves into the Americas. One that's easier to overlook or ignore. They had enslaved them. At Gilcrease Museum, that story is told one document at a time. And so within the collection, we can tell the story of slavery from the very beginning. To better preserve its archives and share them with the public, the museum embarked on its first major expansion in over 25 years. Kinds of material in the archival collection, rare books, maps, documents, that will be now safely protected, stored, and conserved within the Helmerich Center for American Research. The center boasts state-of-the-art facilities for housing the documents that make up most of its collection and aims to be a global destination for American scholarship. And will allow much more research of the archival collection from researchers all over the world, literally, but also for TU students. Even if that research at times proves unflattering, there's still plenty to take pride in, all safely passed on to future generations. These types of documents in the collection that help tell the story of American history. That was Chris Wiley reporting. Now the Helmrich Research Center opens to the public next weekend, and we put a link to the site at kjrich.com for you.